Hey, what's going on guys? You guys have tuned in to the Best Price Nutrition YouTube channel. I'm John, I got Brad here with me today, and uh, we've been waiting on this video for months. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we got in the, I guess it's not necessarily new new, but it's new to us, the Ghost uh, Blue Raspberry Sour Patch Kid Energy Drink. We've had the, uh, we've had the red one in for a while. It's been a favorite around yeah. here at the office. Also a favorite amongst our customers. Tastes amazing. Uh, I really like that a lot of these uh, supplement brands are starting mm -hmm. to partner with mainstream food companies. We're actually getting like the real candy flavor. It's not like the off name. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. And there's some exciting ones coming out from a, a lot of brands. And I think Ghost has another uh, either grape or strawberry bubblicious yeah. partnership coming out. So I'm excited to try that one. Yeah. And pretty much, I haven't had much Ghost, pro many Ghost products. But what I've heard from their proteins and everything, because they partnered with Nabisco, I think, and they got like all like the cookies and all yeah, those flavors. Right. Apparently, they're incredible. Like beyond even just what Ghost says, like all of the reviews are really, really good, and we have seen that with this. Um, what are the other flavors we have? Yeah. Are, we, are we still carrying rice? Uh, kind of, sort of. Sort of. Yeah. Rye, you know, they're tough to get in. Rise is actually doing a bunch of, I, I forget the... I just saw it on Snack. Like they just came on, yeah. Big mainstream candy or yeah. snack brands that they're partnering with here in the future. So. Yeah, it, it, must, it must be pretty pretty lucrative for both companies to do that. So it's kind of exciting to see that happening more and more often. So for anyone who's not familiar with Ghost, what do we got? How does this stack up against some of the other energy drinks in terms of caffeine or BCAs, yeah. nootropics? So the, I guess like the gold standard is kind of like Bang Energy Drink. That's what everyone knows. It's super popular. Bang Energy, I think, has some amino acids in there, um, and then it's 300 milligrams of caffeine, and that's pretty much it, as far as I know. Maybe like the creatine or whatever, but it's probably not in there in any noticeable amount. This has Carnipure, which is L-carnitine, L-tartrate, at one gram. It's got a gram of taurine, 200 milligrams of natural caffeine, 150 milligrams of alpha-GPC, which is nootropic. It's really good for focus. You've got Neurofactor, um, which is coffee fruit extract, 100 milligrams. Then you have estrogen at 25 milligrams, which is like an absorption thing. So you got 200 milligrams of natural caffeine, which some people notice the difference. I think we've talked about this before. Between caffeine and hydrous, which is like the synthetic caffeine and natural caffeine, there's kind of a different feel. It just doesn't hit as hard, I feel I, like. I, I, it doesn't hit as hard, but I find it to be a little bit smoother and yeah. less crazy feeling. Yeah, it's just not so much of a punch, which is really, really good, I feel like. I mean, it just depends on what you're doing. And I don't know about you, but for me, 200 milligrams is kind of a perfect. You know, bangs are a little bit more much. than I need, a little bit yeah. intense. So I, I think the 200 milligrams hit like this and like a 3D energy habit is just about perfect. Yeah, and, and as I'm drinking probably thousands of energy drinks now, I can't really do a lot of the 300 milligrams. It's just too much. Makes me feel kind of queasy. Anything, like you said, 200, 100 to 200, maybe 250, that's like the perfect range for an energy drink. Um, and a lot of the bang flavors just make me feel sick now. I'm so used to them all. You, you know what I just noticed? Uh, so th this one has five calories. And not to knock the, the zero calorie energy drinks, but personally, even if it's only five, 10, 20 calories, the ones that have a little bit of calories in there, I find taste better than the yeah. ones that are, are zero calorie. And, and even with the five calories, you have to think, the energy you're gonna get and the fidgeting you're gonna do and the legs you're gonna be shaking from the caffeine, from the stimulants, you're gonna burn off that calorie, those five calories, very, very easily. Like, it's it's a non-issue. I think what a tic-tac, tic-tac. Uh, yeah, tic it's five. Tic-tac, tic excuse me. A tic-tac is what, yeah, five or eleven yeah. or something yeah. like that. Wow, Tic Tac and Tic Tac are one letter off. <laughs> never compare them. Um, but yeah, let's try it. Have you tried this one? I have not. Neither have I. I really like the red. I mean, the red is spot on, so I imagine this is going to be good. Yeah. And there's really no artificial colors or anything. It's just kind of like a beige-ish. Cheers. That smells exactly smells like Sour Patch Kid. Off the get-go, it's so heavy right here with how sweet it is, but the flavor is really, really good. You know what? The not knocking it, because I really do like it, but the the scent of it is a lot more powerful than the actual flavor. To be honest, if I had my eyes closed and you gave me the red one and the blue one, I don't know if I'd be really? able to differentiate because the smell smells exactly like the red one. Well, yeah, you know, I think Sour Patch Kids have that very distinctive like. To me, it smells like Swedish fish. Yeah, I can see that. So, like, the red one smelled exactly like it, and I smelled it again in here. Maybe one of these days we'll have to do a side-by-side -side of these two. 
It's good. I feel like this one's a little more tart than the other one. But it's it's not tart. It's just more on the... It is really sweet. You know what I'm saying? I don't hate it. I thought I wanted to, because Jeff likes it so much, and I want it to be contrarian, but it is pretty good. So yeah, so Jeff, another guy who we work with, uh, yeah. has actually been shopping competitors just to get this yeah. drink. We're barely keeping the lights on because of Jeff. <laughs> um, um, but yeah, he, he's, been, he's been on us to get this drink in for, for yeah. months, so they, yeah. A lot of people around here really love it. I can see myself grabbing one of these. I, I yeah. think I still might gravitate towards the red. Yeah. But this is very good. I'm, I normally don't like, I don't like blue raspberry, blue, anything like that. It's just always such like a sickeningly sweet fake. I actually like, I mean, obviously, Sour Patch isn't like a natural flavor by any means, but I don't really like blue raspberry, and this one is good. Did you ever do when I was a kid and I'd go to the movies with my friends? I'd eat so many Sour Patch Kids that like all the skin would fall off the oh, yeah. my mouth. Yeah, it's like you eat like all like the citric acid would just like eat away at it. <laughs> yeah, I actually like this quite a bit. Everyone's gonna out there's gonna be mad if you don't leave any for them. I can, don't tell. Them. All right, so we now have the blue raspberry, the red. Great city. We have the blue. <laughs> no, I got a burp. I swallowed that way too fast. <laughs> We've got the blue raspberry, the red sour patch kid one, mango and citrus. Yeah. Yeah. So we've got those four right now. As they come out and as they become available to us, um, they're not always available to us first. But once they are, we'll get them in as soon as we can. Pick up a case. They're not that expensive. Um, or if you're in the Chicagoland area, stop by Capital Nutrition in Mokina, Illinois, Orland Park, Illinois, Sherville, Indiana. Stop by a supplement warehouse uh, in Bolingbrook, Illinois, or West Dallas, Wisconsin. Pick them up. We'll have them at all of the stores by the end of next week. That's a good point for anyone who's in Chicago. You know, I know a lot of times people don't want to commit to a 12 case, yeah. or, or people just like trying different flavors. Um, so yeah, pretty much all our stores and all the coolers, we have some really unique energy drinks. Yeah. We have the uh, the Joe Rogan CBD drinks. Uh, Burp brain. Bird, or bird brain. Yeah, you're not going to see that really anywhere. Uh, Rays. Yeah. Alani News. I mean, huge life. You guys are uh, fans of energy yeah. drinks. Definitely by one of the stores. Yeah, we, we have a ton of them. That's what people are saying. Anytime they go to our energy drinks, they're like, wow, it's a pretty wide selection. It's almost like a gas station with how many different energy drinks that we have. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see us do any other energy drink reviews or think we should bring in any other brands, please leave a comment down below and we will see if we can bring it in and we'll definitely get back to you. Or if you're an energy drink brand, we always like samples. We love samples. All right. Thanks, guys. Later, guys.